How does uranium go from looking like this to the nuclear energy that powers almost 10% of the world? Well, first we have to mine the ore. Almost half of that is done through traditional open pit or underground mining. But over half of the world's uranium is extracted by a method called in situ leaching. Water mixed with oxygen is pumped into the ground to dissolve the uranium, which is then pumped to the surface where it's filtered, separated, and dried into uranium oxide concentrate, sometimes called yellow cake. Now, most nuclear reactors use the isotope uranium-235 as fuel, but that isotope only makes up 0.7% of the natural uranium mined, so it has to be increased through a process called enrichment. The uranium is converted to a gaseous form called uranium hexafluoride, then fed into centrifuges with thousands of spinning vertical tubes that separate uranium-235 from the slightly heavier uranium-238. This increases the 235 concentration to between 3 and 5 percent, which is the level used in most reactors. Next, the enriched uranium goes to a fuel fabrication plant, where it's turned into uranium dioxide powder, pressed into small pellets, and heated to make a hard ceramic material. Those pellets are then loaded into fuel rods, which are what power the reactor. And that's it. Drop us a follow and let me know what mineral we should cover next.